Hi, Ron Maines here for my father, David Maines, whose words continue to live on at 100words.ca. We're continuing in the last book of the Bible, the book of Revelation, chapter 10 today, and our key verses are verses six and seven. There should be delay no longer, but in the days of the sounding of the seventh angel, when he is about to sound, the mystery of God would be finished, as he declared to his servants, the prophets. John's apocalyptic vision continues as a mighty angel comes down from heaven. He is of immense size, his body robed in a cloud with a rainbow above his head, his face shining like the sun and his legs like fiery pillars. He places one foot on the sea and the other on the land, raises his hands to heaven and shouts with a lion's roar. <laughs> John not only converses with this immense angel, but is also able to take a scroll from the angel's hand and eat it. The scroll tastes sweet, but turns John's stomach sour. John is told after eating it that he must prophesy again about many peoples, nations, languages, and kings. Perhaps the key ingredient in the scroll has to do with the mystery of God being accomplished after the seventh trumpet is blown. And that mystery is very much related to our Lord who will reign forever and ever, according to verse 15. A prayer for today is, Lord Jesus, you are the King of kings and the Lord of lords. You reign supreme. I look around me and I see confusion, violence, and evil men destroying people's lives. I pray for insight to see that ultimately you will bring about your will on earth, amen.